the particular class that I have been I have been teaching this weekend deals with healing. This has to do with tools in assisting people on how to heal and how to transform and eventually, you know, how to how to cope with reality, really. He was born into a thousand-year-old tradition of mountain and jungle healers, shamans, and mystics. He has been extensively trained in the medicine traditions of the Americas, with particular interest in his native Andes and the Amazon culture. He is an accomplished naturalist, explorer, and mountain guide, and he is also university trained and an engineer in computer sciences. He is fluent in Spanish, Quechua, and English. He is the chairman of the Andean Research Institute and conducts training and programs in North America, Europe, and also in his native Peru. Can I, join your I, I worked as a civil engineer. I worked as, as a systems analyst. I worked in corporate America wearing a suit and a tie. And then one of those days I decided to wear a poncho. When I look back at, the his, at, at my own history, my own, my own story with these medicine traditions, uh, a lot of this information, even though it was available, you had to, to look in the right places. I met medicine people, people that worship mountain spirits. Uh, I spent a great deal of time uh, learning with the you know, jaguar shamans, the ayahuascaros. And they're incredible, incredible whistlers, musicians. They channel the voice of the rainforest. I followed them. They became, to an extent, teachers, gurus to me. You know, I had to choose, you know, to, how do I serve the world in a, in a more provo uh, provocative way as far as creating opportunity and magic. And let's dialogue intimately with spirit, envisioning, tracking ourselves, remembering what our healed state is about, feels like, looks like, remembering what is the best possible expression that we can summon ourselves into in this lifetime? What is our highest, most highest possibility as individuals in this lifetime? Let's track it with prayer. Moon as Santa Cosa in Chispa.